Hi guys, not all shopping trips are alike. Share feedback. Okay, so I'm sharing my feedback with you all. I went shopping today at Target's Dollar Spot or what's known as their Bullseye's Playground and oh my gosh, they had even more spring stuff out and yes, I got a lot more stuff. So yes, today's video is going to be my spring shopping haul from their Bullseye's Playground and this is going to be part two. So let's go ahead and start watching and see what I got. The first items that I picked up are these. They are natural woven baskets and I just love how they look. They really look handmade. These baskets are pretty deep as you can see. They have a nice wide base. There are handles on each end looking like that. And when you look at them, all of the colors are like in varying shades of this natural tone. So it really, really gives it interest. I mean, I love things that look handmade, seriously. And this is called a woven basket medium. So I guess that's the size, it's medium. It is $5 and the DPCI is 2341202221. And I went ahead and pulled out one basket so you could see exactly what it looks like. It's just like a simple woven basket. You can see the handles are like this. They don't go up. They're just on the side like that. And they just look pretty. I'm planning to use them inside of my linen closet to probably store small items, maybe nail polishes, maybe bath bombs, maybe toothpaste, toothbrushes, just little things that would fall through the holes of bigger wire baskets. So yes, this is so perfect and I can't wait to start using it and start organizing my closets. It could probably be used inside of my bathroom as well, maybe under the counters, maybe inside of my bedroom closets on top. Who knows? There's so many ways you can use this. The next item that I picked up is this mini art caddy and it is super cute. I love that they've made it in this natural wood tone color. It looks like this on the inside and what makes this unique is the front. You can see here it has a window with a screen right there so it just gives it a little more style now they have these in other colors that's already painted like I think they have a teal color they might have a yellow pink white I'm not too sure I just remember there were some bright colors and then there was this and I decided to go with this color right here now this is three dollars and the DPCI is two three four two eight zero zero seven seven If you're wondering, this is what the side looks like. And the reverse side looks like this. So if you really didn't like that screened in front, you could just flip it to the back and then fill it up and then you would not be able to see. The then as I was looking around, I got super excited to find this item right here. This crate here says Farm Fresh and is done in a wood tone and it has six compartments how awesome is that so my mind is already racing thinking about ways that i could use this perhaps i could put just eggs in here with a bunny some flowers maybe i could put different plants in here the ideas are endless i mean i love using crates as opposed to trays because it just makes it a lot more fun so i can't wait to start using this and in case you don't like having the words farm fresh on here you could kind of turn it around so this is what the side looks like it's plain like this and then when you turn it again you can see the back is also plain as well so if you didn't like the words you can just turn it all the way to the back and just have a plain side just like this what I found interesting is that I saw people online turning the crate over like this and using them as shelves. I thought that was super cool because people were placing little plants in them, those with the little planters that you can get from Target's Dollar Spot or from the Dollar Tree or Walmart or wherever. You could put little figurines in here. And if you're a Ray Dunn fan, 
I tried a Ray Dunn mug will not fit in here so that won't work but then again there's so many things you could use this for and it's just super exciting this crate is five dollars and the dpci is two three four two one zero seven seven nine next up i picked up these lemons which i am super excited about they are ceramic lemons and i bought some last year and i was always hoping to find more and thank goodness i was able to find them i was able to get two of the half lemons and you can see what it looks like on the front and two of the full lemons i mean how cute are these they do have a flat bottom and that's how they're able to just sit like this the lemons are a dollar each and they share the same dpci which is two three four two one one zero zero four as i was looking around i saw a whole bunch of different picks and honestly they look really cute but there were so many different styles i didn't know which ones to get and so i kind of decided on picking three of these the three right here and then seeing how i like them so let me go ahead and show you what they look like you have this one that's a lot darker with pointed edges they're kind of rounded and then pointed they're really nice vibrant green and the stem looks brown like that the next one here is done in a softer pastel tone and the edges are more rounded and you can see that the stem looks green like this and finally this last one here you can see the leaves are really thin and pointed looking and again it has a stem that looks brown but now this one's a lot more curved so i think it's really cool that these all have different types of stems and different types of leaves i mean they got really creative here which i really really like because you know you don't want everything to look the same sometimes you want things that look a little different and again these were only a dollar each so i didn't mind picking up these different ones because they were only a dollar and you can see the dpci is two three four two one zero seven six six and there you go i thought these were just so cute i'm hoping that i do like them because then i'll go ahead and buy some more and finally, I fell in love with these bud vases. Oh my gosh, how beautiful are these? They look like watercolors. These here are in the color yellow. That's what it says on the bottom. And oh my gosh, they just look like a beautiful watercolor. Now, there are two different types of tops or openings. This one actually goes up diagonally like that and then it gets flat on top you see that and I got four of these because these were my favorite color and then after I got these four I decided that I wanted to get the clear ones because they looked really pretty and simple and so here they are the clear bud vases they are done in exactly the same style as the yellow ones and again look how pretty they look oh my gosh i was gonna get two and then i was like you know what three would be really pretty so yes i ended up buying these three and now i want more and then i was going to stop there but i saw the pink ones and i was like you know what valentine's is here and easter's coming up and I think the pink would be really pretty to add in, especially because it's spring. So I ended up with two of these pink vases. They're actually called coral underneath. That's the color that they're calling it, even though they look pink and they look gorgeous. It's not like coral, it's not like pink. It's almost like a pinkish purple color put together, if you know what I mean and done in more of a watercolor style, which I love. And if you notice here, the tops of these bud vases are straight up just like a bottle see that they're not curved like the other ones so i ended up getting these these are a dollar each and the dpci is two three four two one one zero one eight and when you look at them all together they look so gorgeous in fact if you just line them up and put them somewhere maybe by a windowsill It'd be beautiful as is.
And again, here's the tops of them all together. And oh my lanta, these are gorgeous. And you can see that the pink bud vases in that style are definitely taller than the yellow and the clear bud vases in these styles. But oh my gosh, they are gorgeous, don't you think? I love these. Well guys, this is everything that I picked up from Target's Dollar Spot, or what's known as their Bullseye Playground, from their spring line. And I am super happy that I went back to check it out because I love the new stuff that I found. I mean, I love the materials they're using, like the woods and then the woven material and the glass. Everything looks so beautiful and natural and I love it. It's not so plasticky or anything like that. I just love the colors as well. When you look at it, you can definitely see spring is on its way, but it's not so bright or in your face. And it's not pastel either. It's more of like a watered down tone, if you know what I mean. Like the yellows, they're not bright or pastel, but they're just kind of watered down and soft. Same as the corals or what's known as the pinks. Again, they're looking so soft and pretty. I just love it. So guys, I hope you enjoyed watching my video. I hope that you share it with your friends. I hope you like it. And if you haven't done so already, I hope you subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day, guys.